Hey guys, back at the plane, last day now on the road. It's been uh, it's the 17th day, we're finally going home. So it's been an amazing adventure like you've seen. Visiting Africa has been incredible. Um, we actually got to fly over uh, my home country, believe it or not. I mean, just everything's been incredible. Um, now we're uh, all set to go home. Um, it's gonna be a long day. We have three pilots on today. Um, as you may have noticed, and our flight attendant. Uh, the reason for that is we call this an augmented crew, so we're flying a little like an airline today where our pilot's gonna take turn um, resting during the day so that we can make it home uh, within the duty day. So we get an extended duty day today with three pilots. Uh, we get 21 hours, that's because on the Global XRS in the 6000s, there's an actual crew rest area. Um, that we can use to lay down and sleep. I'll show you that in a bit. Um, so we're looking at eight hours, two eight hour flights uh, back home with a stop in, uh, in Senegal for fuel. And then uh, weather should be good. It'll be quite the shock to go back to cold and snow. Uh, it was an early wake up this morning, two in the morning. Um, that's another reason why we have three guys there. It's gonna be a, it's gonna be a long day, but it's gonna be a fun day, and I uh, hope you guys enjoy the ride back. That's our uh, oil replenishment pa uh, panel. Um, as you can see here, we would turn it on, and you select which engine you want the oil to go in. Um, I'm sorry, you can't really read what this says, but this says pump on, and this says valve open. Um, so while this is happening, this is behind the left hand seat here and while this is happening we keep an eye on here and you can see the reservoir quantity um, that's typically what we'll be looking at here because the engine quantity takes a little bit of time to react to what's going on. So as you can see here we're all set up uh, we got uh, the charts are all set we're getting our fuel right now we got uh, quite the trip today going from here all the way up to Dakar and then we're going to cross the Atlantic Ocean all the way home. Uh, let's take a trip back to the back of the plane and see what else is there. All right, so uh, this here is a crew rest area. It doesn't look like much right now, but uh, it's going to be cleaned up and this is where uh, flight crews are going to take turn rotating. You can see that there's a curtain here that can be closed all the way. And this lays flat so that uh, it answers the requirements for a crew rest area. Tout ce qui est rond est bon. Clap, prise, un vision panoramique. Une caméra avance, gros plan sur Dominique. Seul devant la classe et l'ausculte son corps. Puis il crie machinalement encore quelques efforts. Tous les régimes sur elle furent testés. Toutes les tentatives ont été des échecs. Que quand elle met des persévères et pour plaire à son homme, Dominique a décidé de suivre la norme. Et le haut magazine des magazines dans lesquels elle pense trouver le record ultime. Mazo, à la suite de ses formes en deux lettres, elle était occupée à couper du cul.
Alright, so we're leaving Senegal now. Um, we just did a cruise on too. See them uh, in the cruise crew rest area now. Now a passenger for the next um, couple of hours, I guess. I'll figure out how to do the next uh, cruise shift. And uh, we're on our way home back to Canada now. Alright, stick along for the ride, we're halfway there. Around in the spot here, if that does work for you guys. Check. I really like the way these engines start too, like super cash. I like yeah, it that takes a lot. Its time. Yeah. A nice quiet air flow Six. Check. Hey guys, and welcome back to the Global Life. Uh, is that better? That better? No. Ah, there we go. Welcome back to the Global Life. It's the morning after. Um, we're in Quebec City now. We finally finished our trip. It's been 18 days since day one. We left November 1st. It's now. It's been 18 days. <laughs> um, 
yeah, I mean, thank you for sticking with this with us on this adventure. I know it's been a long video, um, a lot happening, and um, for us, it's been a truly amazing trip. I mean, like everything that we got to do and see, and I mean, I didn't even. I, I didn't even go on safari or anything else like this. Like, I mean, all we did was like basic store stuff, and it was just crazy. Um, aside from just being nerdy tourists, uh, the whole operation side of things was uh, a challenge. But I mean, kudos to our team, to our dispatching team, um, to everybody else that was involved because that made the, who made this a truly successful trip. So thank you guys. Um, that was great. Um, it, trip is now over. Uh, we're carrying on with more flying now somewhere else in the world. Um, and I hope that you guys uh, stick along for the ride. So this is it for today's video. Um, I know it was a lot, a lot, a lot of stuff in there. I really hope that you enjoyed um, the, the, the cinematic, the just, you know, seeing Africa through our eyes because to me, I mean, it was a trip that was dear to my heart. Uh, most of you probably don't know, but this is where I was born. Um, so it was amazing going back over there and uh, just seeing this beautiful continent once again. So, again, thanks for uh, watching, guys. Welcome back. And, um, yeah, until next time, enjoy. Stay flying. Keep the blue side up. And uh, don't get in too much trouble. So this is JD signing off, guys.